what's going on so here is a new music update collection my michael jackson variant cover collection so let's get started coming up first this is how the cover and when i ordered this the disc was good but there was but it barely played which was off the wall coming up next is one that i reordered that does play that does work is the first original release of Michael Jackson's Off the Wall on audio CD followed up by the variant cover version or the special edit edition version of Michael Jackson's Off the Wall with the legs followed up this was during the time of the when was it Destiny Tour because that is the Destiny Tour look because the suit is different if you just look th this suit right here compared to what he had on and this one in two different looks that's when he got his nose done and this one right here compared to this one you guys can see that so there's those looks right there coming up next is the first early u.s print release of michael jackson's thriller right there along with the laser disc right there. and we'll have the 25 anniversary edition there's that by this you have the back that's different right there show you guys the uh, disc right there or gold followed up by that as well which is the DVD Then we have 25 anniversary, 25 anniversary again, but with a different cover. That is a variant with the red jacket, right there. You can see the back is the werewolf transformation compared to what you had in the back of this one. So as you can see, there's the difference. Um, the the booklet is the same that you would get in the other 25 anniversary one. And so are the CDs compared to the back picture, which is behind the scenes look. So there is that. And here is a fan made of Michael Jackson's Thriller. Except this right here are the songs that never made it on to the album cut. Which to me, I think rather than getting the DVD, I, wouldn't pref I would not prefer a two-disc set of being it. Of being the songs that didn't make it onto the cut which are actually now out on YouTube that you can find and I, I, I would have thought that would have been a better choice to just having a two disc set one with the album songs that you got and the other disc with the songs that didn't make it on to the um, album and especially the original recording of Thriller which isn't even called Thriller it's called Star Knight or Star Guy with whole different lyrics like wow so i really recommend you guys um go on youtube type in a thriller unheard songs and you guys will see oh my god it's just different so there's that with that coming up early u.s release print which is an old which is the older version that i got that is worn out which is michael jackson bad love it Bad is my favorite error, but my favorite album is Dangerous. Followed up by the special edit edition, which is the black cover with um actual picture booklet with pictures in it. This I got from Goodwill, so it's not all the way intact, but it's there. Coming up next is the 25th anniversary of Bad. What? I like what they did with the cover. They made it like a sticker inside. <laughs> And it is a two disc set there. And the second disc are unreleased tracks that didn't make it onto the uh, bad album cut. And one of my favorite unheard tracks have to be the Price of Fame. And this is what I w and this is what I was talking about that they should have did with Thriller. They should have just added the songs that didn't make it on to the album as a second disc but that's what it is 
Coming up next. Coming up next. But before I begin, let me show you all three variants. There's that one, followed up by the special edition. And right there. So you guys can see. They are not. They're all different covers. Same songs compared to the 25 anniversary version. Coming up next is the early U.S. release print of Michael Jackson's Dangerous. So here's the first cover print. Okay. Compared to the edit edition, which came out it's about early 2000s. So you guys can see the difference. I'm trying to get the glare out in the covers. Um, the back... The back is the backs, yeah. The backs are different as well, as you can see. Um, one is a picture booklet compared to the other. So the original U.S. release is lyrics compared to the special edition. Take a look at the CD from the early U.S. Re re release, and then the special edit edition release right there. So yeah, so that's the early U.S. release of Dangerous, and the special edit edition of Dangerous as well. Coming up next is something that we should have gotten, we, we should have gotten, but it didn't happen because the Michael Jackson estates is bullshit, call it for what it is, and we were supposed to get Dangerous 25. You know, Dangerous is one of my favorite albums. So I decided to go ahead and make one myself, and it's a two disc set, and what it is, it has the album cut songs on the first disc, and on the second disc is the unheard tracks, what are very great, and I would have imagined that's what they would have done if they, if the estate would have actually released Dangerous 25, you know, it wouldn't have been in this kind of packaging, it would have been a bit better than what I could do. Which I do do my own designs and everything. Because I make music and do all my own CDs. But I would imagine it would have been a two disc set like that. It would have been the album cuts. And then the second disc would have been the unheard tracks. And probably unseen photos of the dangerous error in the booklet. So Coming up now next is Michael Jackson's Wood on the Dance Floor. This I think is either my... First or second Michael Jackson album I ever bought on audio CD. I loved it. I played the hell out of it to where it didn't work anymore. So I had to buy a new one. Yeah. Blood on the Dance Floor, to me, in my opinion, is one of the best. It's, it's a history in the mix album. But I know before that, compared to how you look at the, um, the timeline, as you know, there was history... Um, I did a video year like two years ago, maybe three years ago, about a you know certain Prince um, albums and Michael Jackson albums. And the Michael Jackson album for history, if I consider it filler because it's not canon to his uh, catalog of his albums. Um, but I know after that, even after Blood on the Dance Floor, really before the history tour. Over Across Seas, they released the blue variant cover of History, which I made myself. But the difference is, is that Over Across Seas, they had two versions. They had the, uh, the History version, which was Disc 2. It was just Disc 2, which I said I made myself. But over here in the U.S. version... We, we didn't get the audio CD version like that. What they gave us was in a, was in a you know, CD case like this. But it was the blue variant cover version. But having it be in the songs, it was the DVD. But like I said, very little the audio CD version that was like this was barely even shipped over here across seas to the U.S. So if you find one in the U.S. that says audio CD somewhere in the corner right here or like a sticker and condition hold on to that because that's worth money compared to the DVD version of this which is like this in the case 
you know, in the album audio CD case. Yeah, it's okay to have your collection, but it, but it's not what I want. Like I said, I'm a music history buff, and I remember seeing in Walmart a long time ago when I was young, around 97, 96, in between one of those years along with the history tour taking off, was this blue variant cover version with the audio CD of the second disc, which is really the history album within itself. And it did say volume two, like this one. So I made that myself to add to the collection. So yeah, I just wanted to share that, you know, it, that's important. As you know, we got This Is It, followed up by Michael or Breaking News. With the, I had to replace this because somebody stole the CD. And the thing about it with the CD I had, it had a crown on it. it had this crown on it on the disc along with the two angels. So there's obviously two different covers. Two, disc, two different disc covers of that. But I bought it again with the CD. But as you can see, it doesn't have the crown on it and stuff. So that lets me know that there's two different versions of this disc. And coming up is Escape, which I got the gold version. What comes with the DVD. And last but not least is a fan-made version. Something that I made that will go into the next music collection video. <laughs> Michael Jackson and Prince. So as you know, Prince will be coming up soon. Tomorrow. So this is my Michael Jackson music update. Variant cover versions. So everything is complete. I'm good. I'm glad. Boom. Got that finished. So I'll be seeing you guys next time.